On Tuesday, May 30th, 2017, comedian Kathy Griffin shocked America by holding up a bloody, decapitated head of President Donald Trump. Most people, including yours truly, found this picture to be too graphic, too tasteless, not funny, and way out of bounds. Even people who dislike Donald Trump found this image to be vulgar and upsetting. Needless to say, the Internet was pissed. So in record time, only a few hours later, with a stupid haircut, Kathy Griffin released a lame attempt at an apology video. Hi, it's me, Kathy Griffin. I'm a comic. I crossed the line. I'm sorry. Bitch, you know exactly what you were doing. Kathy Griffin, people aren't stupid. That apology sucked. And the Internet was more pissed. A few days later, in an attempt to make it all about her, Kathy Griffin, with her two bozo lawyers, has a press conference. What the fuck? At this point, the Internet is like, Finish her! She's losing all kinds of money. She got fired by CNN. Comedy venues are canceling left and right. And now she's trying to play the victim. Basically, she's saying that the Trump family is bullying her and she's blaming everything on old white guys. Yes, she's blaming the white man for all of her problems. So in this same press conference, Kathy Griffin was like, fuck Donald Trump. He picked the wrong redhead. And then she began to cry like a bitch. She was like, Donald Trump broke me. He broke me. So the moral of the story, Kathy Griffin, is that you can't hold up the severed head of the president of the United States. It's just tasteless. The Secret Service is going to investigate you. People are going to hate you. And most of all, you're going to get hit right in the pocketbook. Fatality. If you enjoyed this video, please share, give a thumbs up, like us, or subscribe. This is O with the World Hip Hop Report.